So I'm going to do some stencils here. I did a test run the other day and they came out super tight, man. So I'm stoked on it. Um, so I'm finally stenciling, man. This is pretty much how I do it. I just uh, I lay the t-shirt flat out. Sometimes I have a, a thingy here to mask things off with. Other times I don't. Um, today I don't. I'm just going to position my stencil now. Like so. It's like you got to decide whether or not you want to do a double or a, or a single. I think with this one I'm going to do a double. I don't know if it helps or not. But then basically you just get this thing started and you spray the shit in there. After it's after it's stenciled, it's this easy, man. Yeah, seriously. Mm -hmm. Hard part's cutting the stencil out and getting a good design, I guess. The other part you just have to have a little patience with and not screw it up. So now I'm going to move this thing here. Get this out of the way. I'm going to drag it down a little bit and re-register it. And hopefully not screw that up too bad. I want to write in words in these things so I'm going to try and get it right. And then we do it again. This stuff is like non-toxic so I like that. Because the other stuff I'm using is nasty real spray paint <clears throat> for my uh, CD jackets, you know. Not so good. I need to get my ve ventilator, respirator, but that's down in the the basement. A little overspray in there. That's my little signature. Something a screen printer can't do, right? And it sometimes covers up the screw-ups, too. So... There's a shirt. I'm going to do a bunch this morning. I ran out of ink on this one, so I went a little crazy and did some other stuff with it. It's kind of neat. This is where the creative stuff comes in, you know. But uh, we got a bunch of them done, as you can see. <laughs> 